I mean, we often speak about people pleasing and mm -hmm. just as a disclaimer, I'd like to say that people pleasing is on a spectrum. It's not like people pleasers, non-people pleasers. Um, there's mm -hmm. a healthy measure of pleasing others that we all need to be able to engage in because relationships are about give and take or they're about mm -hmm. compromise and sharing. So all those nice things that make our social spaces, you know, run smoothly. However, there is a level of people pleasing that is very unhealthy where we mm -hmm. don't have boundaries and we struggle to prioritize ourselves or our health or our ambitions. Mm -hmm. um, and even something like where we struggle to ask ourselves question like, questions like what's in it for me, you know? Mm -hmm. So overcoming the need to, to please others or fit in firstly involves a level of self-reflection. Learn mm -hmm. how to do self-introspections. Ladies, and the guys mm -hmm. who are watching, learn how to self-introspect. This is not just about picking out your flaws or seeing what you're good at and ignoring the rest. This may mean things like checking who you are and why you behave a certain way in certain environments. If you, if you generally struggle with self-introspection, try writing down your thoughts and emotions, especially when you're having maybe a difficult week or a difficult day. Um, mm -hmm. You can also then find, you know, or create healthy spaces with, people you trust or who you've known in different phases of your life or who are maybe in similar situations or phases as you and normalize talking about real life experiences because then that will pick out, okay, so in this environment, I don't really fit, but what's causing me to want to fit there? Um, but the most important thing I think um, when we're looking at why people please and how we want to fit in is, is looking at the self and being intentional about you. Um, so I, I, I know I said self-introspection and I was like, yeah, we should all be able to self-introspect. And to tell the mm -hmm. truth, some people don't have as much insight to be able to do that. So if you do need to do that, you can kind of speak to a professional. I always mm -hmm. say that if you have access to a professional, please use it. You don't need to wait for a crisis in your life to have an understanding of how to manage a life crisis. So mm -hmm. kind of going back to the question about why you may have a need to fit in There'll be different answers for different people. However, try to find out for yourself. Introspection may mean checking how you feel about certain people and why. Some of those answers you have, you already do have internally. Is it about you? Is it about them? Um, I mean, there's a fine line between admiring, for example, and being jealous. And that line typically has to do with like self-worth and self-identity. Mm -hmm. So how do you value yourself? And then how do you value yourself in relation to others? This part really speaks to that, you know, that kind of becoming your authentic self. And when you're there, then you can see that, okay, here, this relationship is not really serving me the way it needs to serve me. And mm -hmm. I'm going to put a boundary there. Or well, this environment doesn't fit for me. So I'm going to move myself out of it because it's just not working. And you can mm -hmm. trust yourself enough to be able to go there and, and be fine with it.